Hi, Super Fans, and today we're going to do 3D art. I don't mean by 3D art, I mean, I don't mean by like clay. We're not crafting clay here, we're drawing a picture. Instead of drawing a picture with this like 2D art where the background and we draw the characters on the background and we draw them first, we're actually going to draw the characters on here and cut them out and glue them onto the background. That's what we're going to do. We're going to use color pencils for the background. We're going to use markers, start beads, and glue and scissors for the things on the back, things on it to make it 3D. So that's what we're going to be doing. So, so now I'm going to do time lapse of the background. Come right back when I'm done with the background. Bye. See you when the time lapse of drawing the background is done. So now I'm back from the time lapse. If you saw like those little orange lines and those lines on the sun, you, you wonder why I did them. It's because I was trying to make a realistic, and I'm not the best realistic. And also I drew a sky, some clouds, the sun, and grass, like a normal background, like a classic background. And we're going to now draw my characters and why is my su supplies here? Did I just forget all my supplies? So, why do I keep forgetting stuff? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Lion, I'm talking to you. Where do you put my supplies? Um, in the living room and the kitchen. Over there. Okay, it looks like we're going to go for a scavenger hunt to find my supplies. Can you please not do this ever again? Yes. Okay. So my scissor and pencils are with a um, Lego construction book and TV remotes. I don't know why. Okay. And the markers are behind my Swiss and next to my TV. Why are markers there? Makes absolutely no sense. There, there. Okay. That's the wrong drawer, but oh, there's goldfish and cheerios and toast crap and waffles. Okay. And why is there a sarpy and a food container? Why? And I also got some more goldfish and sour going worms. And let me get this over here. Okay. I don't know why it was in a food container. I just don't know why. Why were you in a food container? Well, Starbase cannot talk. We all know that. Okay. So now we're going to this. Okay, so okay, I already can see this like from June sixteen. Okay, I'm all okay. And by the way, this is also my play. This is also my like door of craft supplies or like art supplies. We got pie cones. Also got stamps. We got stickers. We got balloons. We got puffy paint. I'm not even decorating through my fabric. 
Oh, okay. We got a cartons, a paint palette. We got a paint bowl with a glue stick for some reason. We got more paint. Got markers, paper here. We got my intro, my free card challenge. Um, some other drawings. What else we got there? We got this drawing. Oh, I remember this one. This one's from me. Um, my color pens. I did a story of them. Me and Armored Dog. I remember this. The end. That's cool. And we got kid scissors. Maybe I still use these from this video. And also, other things. And. Oh! What's in that? Oh, that's my German house. Oh, that's from my Christmas video. Uh, what's in here? Oh, that's also from my Christmas video. There's a ton of stuff. What? Okay. Oh, that's. What's this? Okay. Um, we got. I'm trying to read. This is black and white. We also got. Aubrey Dog. Cowboy Woody. I mean. I mean. I mean. Cowboy Donald or Donald the Cowboy. And. Becky, it's got Aubrey Dog. I also got Aubrey's back. <laughs> okay. L oh, my nose is. We got headset bunnies. We got the normal one, a glow in the dark one, and the lecture cube one. Okay. Very interesting. We also got a, my Kratos book in here, some other supplies, and do you have any else papers? Okay. Okay, that's his car. Oh, what's that? Oh, that. This is more and more. And there's a ton of random stuff. Okay. Ton of random stuff. Coming. And, oh, those are my tape creaser things. Okay. So, wow. There's a lot of drawings in there. I also got, um, Mario. Why is Mario in here? I don't know. Oh, yeah, because I used it for the stand. Okay. And a clay container? What? More puppy paint? Okay. Let's stop getting distracted. Here. Okay. Let's, I got my glue stick here. Now let's go back. Okay. So now I have all my supplies from that scaver hunt. Now I'm going to go draw a time masters of the characters I'm going to make to put on the drawings. And, and, and the thing I'm going to be drawing here, the animal I'm going to be drawing is food theme. So guess what food I'm going to base it off of. And now we're going to do the time masters. So, bye! See you when we're back into the time masters.
guys are probably asking yourself, what did you just draw? What is this? Why is this? Why is this line green? Why it does it look like he has chalk on him? Why does he look like he he's made out of candy? This this chill, you guys, just chill, okay? I'm gonna explain it now. This is a carm. This is a lion dream after a caramel apple. If you don't know what a caramel apple is, I'm gonna explain right now. Caramel apple are these things that they dip the apple like in caramel, I think. And then they cover all these treats and candies and sprinkles and stuff. You've seen some caramel apples at Disneyland when we go to land we do get caramel apples. So this is why I kind of spider off the caramel apples in Disneyland. But of course, I didn't use the caramel apples in Disneyland because of copyright reasons. So I used my own kind of caramel apple. So the, so the green parts are the apple parts, and this brown that looks like chocolate. It's supposed to be caramel. This is supposed to be caramel, but caramel's way lighter. We got like the red, like the sprinkles, like the red sprinkles. We got the blue sprinkles. We got two little M&Ms. We got the caramel apple stick. I know it's only white, but I just want to give it color. And we got green, makes like, a little candy on his ears. And basically the eye and mouth are candy too. Actually, they're probably not, are not candy. He's seen for sprinkles and caramel. How is he doing that? I don't know. And chocolate. Okay. We're not going to eat this lion. This lion and what is, probably doesn't exist, but you can make it exist. I guess you just put caramel all over a lion. Actually, probably, probably, just don't make this exist, okay? Don't put caramel all over your lion, then sprinkles, and then... Put a stick in them. No. I don't think you should do that to lion. Because lions are dangerous. But I like how they look. Because lions, I don't think they look scary. <laughs> and they are dangerous. So don't. Do not. Do not. Do not. Cover a lion and make a caramel apple lion. Do not do that, okay? <laughs> Because you probably get hurt by doing that. And I don't want you guys to get hurt. So now we're going to draw another animal. We're also another food theme. Um, can you guys guess what food theme is? Okay, now we see. Drew a another animal based on food, and this is a watermelon dog. A watermelon dog. So this, so this is a watermelon dog. We got the little seeds here. We got like the white thing you're supposed to not eat. The rind, yes, the rind, and then we got the skin of the watermelon, the stripes, and then, or because so I'd be considering things black, and the tails they also turn black. That's really cute. Now we're going to draw a last final, and it's going to be a food animal. So what food is going to be? It's not going to be a caramel apple, and it's not going to be a watermelon. So what food is going to be? And it's not going to be a dog or lion. It's going to be a animal. So type in your comments or the Joey Hello. What do you think I'm going to put together with food and with Thai animal?
probably saying, this is so simple. What's kind of for this? It's a blueberry bear. It's a blueberry bear. What about, oh, what about we name him Barry? Because Blueberry is a berry, and his name is Bear, and that's his own line. You guys get it? <laughs> blueberry. A Blueberry Bear. So this is a Blueberry Bear. bear. Kind of twisting my tongue to say it. Should we call this a tongue twister? Maybe. Let's try to say Blueberry Bear, Blueberry Bear, Blueberry Bear. Blueberry bear, blueberry bear, blueberry bear, blueberry bear. Okay. <laughs> I'm just having fun. So this is a blueberry bear. I thought of a blueberry bear. So one time when I was eating blueberries, um, I thought I thought of an idea. Oh, maybe I should draw a blueberry bear. And that why this and this this is where this came from. So those are so those are not all my animals. I'm gonna draw two more. Can you guys guess? Can you guys guess what the two animals are gonna be? Yell them out loud or type them in the comments. like what is this and it's supposed to be an ice cube and um it's supposed to be an ice cube it's supposed to be a live ice cube why am i drawing an ice cube i don't know i'm drawing weird designs here. It's supposed to be a live ice cube and that way it kind of added the little ideas to make it a 3d it's like a 3d ice cube and i'm not that little best at 3D, but I can at least do 3D. My 3D is pretty good. I'm, 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 I'm not like I'm, like, I'm like the best at 3D drawing. I'm not the best at it. I'm not like the, uh, the best at 3D, but I know how to do 3D. And it looks pretty 3D as well. And we got these lines to be like ice lines. A ice cube, a live ice cube under the sun. I don't think I actually used to do this. It's gonna melt. And it's not gonna be very happy to see an ice cube melt. So now we're gonna draw another thing. And this thing is not even an animal. It's a non-animal. It still has animal, but we don't really call it animal. So let me let's see. You can guess and see what I'm drawing. So now I am back from the time lapse, and this is a human. If you guys guessed human, you guys are correct. And this 
actually, fun fact, this is actually cartoon me. Yes, this is me. And since we did me, and since this is drawing, let's draw a triceratop bird on Ice Cube's pays. I drew an ice cube. So let's draw a triceratop bird. I'm drawing triceratop bird because a triceratop bird is like, kind of like my symbol of my channel. Because it's in my intro, not to my series. Because if I did do the intro to my series, all my series, you guys get bored and bored. No, it's not. It's not. I mean, the intro to all my videos. Or the intro, like, um, look at try to see that bird. Are you ready? Are you ready to have some fun? Yeah. And also, it's, it is my thing when I comment on videos. Also, it's that. So. We're going, so I'm going to cut them off of, cut them off on cam, off camera for reasons. First, we can't cut them out on camera because of reasons. Um, because of, it's going to be really dangerous um, to cut them with one hand. You might cut yourself. And you, and I don't want to cut myself. And also, it's just be really hard to um, record cutting, so I'm gonna do it off camera. And currently, I should probably do cutting always off camera, because if I do cutting on camera, it's gonna be really dangerous, and I don't want to cut myself in a dangerous situation. This to cut animals out. And no, 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 no. I mean, drawings out. No, 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 not animals. So there's my triceratop bird. And now we're going to cut them out. And then we're going to glue them on and see the fire zerk. And, and it's on for my 3D art. So let's go do that. So now guys, we are gluing these little cut out on paper. So I'm gonna take my glue and put it on a piece of paper. It's glue, it's this glue, I hope it works. So we're gonna glue I'm gonna try to bird. Huh, his legs. They kind of hard to glue because they're all folded up. And then we got this. We got his little things. Then we got that. And then we're gonna let's glue it like on the side of a cloud right there. I think that'd be a good place to glue it. Oh, so let's not glue it there. Let's glue it right here. I feel dry up, so it'll be fine. And then we got a little triceratop bird on the drawing. See, this is how 3D drawing, this is the 3D artist blooming these guys on the page. It's fine to get around face because there, because it's just gonna dry. And let's make sure to glue this on correctly and this on correctly. Let's glue the beak on, nice and steady. Let's get more glue, nice and steady. There we go. Next, he, I mean, that's drawing is the ice cube. Let's glue him right here. Uh, I think we glue the iron to seven, actually. What's good? Yeah, let's glue here. So let's make him. Oh. Um, maybe let's get a different glue stick. Let's get, I'll get, let's just keep trying this glue stick. Even that, it has a tendency to fall out, I guess. Let's see what's. And then we're gluing him, gluing him, gluing him, gluing him. 
and we're gonna put some glue. There he is, gonna be, and we're gonna put him on here. Okay, there we go. There we go. And then right here, there we go. Here we go, glue. A little cartoon, Aubrey. Or just me. And glue her on here. So glue her on the mountain so it looks like she's walking. We're gonna glue the caramel apple right here because I like because I glue the lines at the zoo. What? I'll be next one. After all, one time I did draw somebody with wine because I love wines and I also love caramel apples and also I love apples. So this is just my favorite things all match into one. Bixley. There we go. We got then we think the watermelon dog going here okay guys um let's move here because there's music and now we can't really hear the music that well now we can continue gluing I'm a different place in my house and we're going to glue the watermelon dog right here. We're gonna glue him right about here next to Cartoon Aubrey, basically me. And we're gonna glue Blueberry Bear. Right here. So it looks like they're talking to their shutters. Like they're having a conversation. My bear's walking out. My bear is walking um, off to this end. And there! My beak on try. Shoot that bird right here. Um, a little harder because it's not gonna stay. And now we got my 3D art piece. And this is very cute. I really like it. We got the watermelon dog, the blue berry bear. We also got the caramel apple lion, cartoon Aubrey, triceratop, triceratop bird, and we also got a live ice cube and there we go and they're all on a realistic background and make sure and i really like this this is really cute make sure you like make sure to subscribe make sure to ring the bell bye there fans i hope you guys like my 3d art